What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to give you another breakfast recipe here. This is high protein, low fat, healthy pancakes. Very simple. We're going to make it right in the Nutribullet. So I'll show you what we need here. First of all, we'll need one cup of oats. Uncooked. Eight egg whites, no yolks, just the egg whites. Okay. I'm gonna show you a little trick if you've never separated eggs before. This is what I do. I use the back side of a butter knife. Okay. Hold the egg, crack it, break it apart. Just rotate back and forth to get all the white out. And I use the knife to avoid getting too many eggshells on it. So I rarely ever have eggshell when I separate eggs. So I'll do eight egg whites. So next we'll add one cup of cottage cheese. This is low fat. You can use high fat or low fat if you want less calories. Obviously low fat. Now, I just put the entire container in it. But uh, you can do what you want. This is 300 gram container. So I want the extra protein. I'm just gonna put the whole thing in it. It's, this container is a bit over one cup. But if you want to actually measure out one cup, you can do that. Make sure that you use the large, if you use a Nutribullet for this, make sure to use the large cup because there's no way that all this stuff is going to fit in the small one. Okay. And now, now we're going to put in one banana. Uh, the riper the better because this will add flavor to it and also add a bit of thickness, so. You can break it up there, just cram it in there. It's pretty full, so just keep that in mind. And I like to top it off with a few flavor drops. This is from my protein. It just gives a little bit of extra flavor. This is toffee flavor, so you could use whatever you want. If you just want to use like some regular vanilla or something, that's fine. So. Okay. And now carefully, of course, because it's very full, Attach the lid. Make sure it's on there securely. You don't want a mess. Okay. Okay, now before I blend all that up, you want to put your pancake pans on the stove top and start heating them up. Pop it in a neutral bullet, blend it up. Okay. You may need 
to shake it a bit to get all the oats browned up in there. Once you're satisfied that everything is ground up properly, there's no oats at the top or anything. Okay, so you want to spray your pans with a frying spray, a cooking spray. Spray your pans with a cooking spray. Make sure it's coated properly. Don't want anything sticking to it. pour a bit in the middle. I'm doing two pancakes at once for two people. And just let them sit there. Now the first batch will usually be about a minute. But just keep an eye on them when they start really like bubbling and you can tell around the sides that they start like cooking more around the sides and it's time to flip them. So the, the first pancakes that you put on there take a little bit longer than the subsequent ones. Okay, these are definitely ready to flip. You see how they're starting to bubble there? Okay, this one's bubbling up here and it looks like around the edges it's starting to cook there. So it looks like it's time to flip it, so. Look at that. Perfection. Golden brown. Let's flip the other one here. Perfect. Now when you flip them over, they only need to sit there for about 30 seconds. You don't need to cook it very long on the other side. So just monitor and make sure that you don't burn them. Okay, so there we go. We have two servings of pancakes. So you can add butter or whatever you want to, to it. And uh, syrup, I'm using a sugar-free syrup by my protein. You can use whatever syrup you want. So this is high protein pancakes, uh, healthy, low fat, all done in a Nutribullet. I absolutely love my Nutribullet. I use it for just about everything. I even grind my coffee in it. So uh, if you don't have a Nutribullet, check the link in the description. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time.